already established that there have always been synergy, cooperation between our union and virtually all the relevant uh, stakeholders from the government side. But our problem is how do we enforce safety and relevant standards? That is the area I want us to emphasize more. We have our own fault as union. We have our limitation. We are union, we are not governments. Okay, from uh, civil defense was constantly referring to our rules. We have these beautiful rules. Our rules is like Nigerian constitution. Nigerian constitution is one of the best in the world, as far as I know. But to what they said, I will be able to implement it. There is no clause that is not in that 99 constitution that we are even condemning. There are beautiful provisions, but to what extent can we implement it? It's the same thing applies to our union. We have our bylaw and we have a better constitution. But this rule does not supersede Nigerian constitution. Our greatest problem is that section 2 of the Nigerian constitution that says there is freedom of association. That's our greatest problem. We have limitation as union. And that's why we're always willing to partner with government agencies. But we have problem with government agencies because they are populated by Nigerians. And Nigerians will have a problem. I keep telling people, when we, when we abuse our leaders, I ask people, has any of our leaders come from Cameroon or Niger? Forget about the speculated worry from uh, what's the other country? Niger. Niger. I don't know a Nigerian person who is from Ghana. They are all Nigerians. And whatever they become, Nigeria makes them to become so. So, uh, government agency, from the handle of civil servant behavior, we have to challenge. We don't get 100% cooperation. Sometimes there is no follow-up. Sometimes there is issue of we can't, we, we cannot. They sometimes they, they, they interpret our intention as intention to force everybody to become to come under our umbrella. But there is freedom of relation. But the truth is that they cannot deal with those unorganized group. Whenever there is an issue, it is with the organized group government call upon. Those scattered one on the street, they cannot, it's not easy for them to trace. So that is why you need to cooperate with us maximally. We need to small. In terms of enforcement, we have limitation. It is you, government agency, legally approved to do certain things that Issue of cylinder, my own from SOX, sir. We, our union has a work relationship with SOX that started in 2003. That me, I can recall. Joining Dr. John Akaya. Hmm? And the Ogapada Fata of SOX. For you to know, John Akaya in 2000, 2000, 2004. Yeah, we, we wrote petition around 2003. We discovered a place along Alaba or Joe Alaba where people are fabricating cylinder. We wrote petition to SOL. That was the genesis of our relationship. They went there, see that place, and since then we are having a lot of robust relationship to the extent that we have participated in every NIS standard code as it regards as uh, Standard of cylinder. Are you are you together? But we have this problem with SOL too. We have always told them there is a need to review these cylinders coming from China. Sometimes they, they say, Are you a scientist? You are traders. And then some of us sleep with cylinder like human. Some of us sleep in the shop. We interact with cylinder, we interface with cylinder. I may not be an engineer, I'm a soul I'm so an academic trainer. But I have I have romanced the cylinder for more than 30 years, three decades. And by handling cylinder, I can to some extent tell you this cylinder is good. But you as a solar as professional, you tell me that no, is your hand is in the app. I don't know if I'm making sense. Why is it that those cylinder produced by NGFC in the battle here last far longer? The so-called new shiny cylinder from China with this glossy paint. 
You display it outside your shop. All that sun, three, four months, that change color. Less than one year, the base, the base has start corroding. Mind you, law should be, law should be tailored in reality to the environment and an economy, a reality of the people. In an economy that cannot pay 30,000 minimum wage. Eh? You expect people to be changing the data every five, five years. As far as we are concerned as retailers, we see it as collaboration, collabo, and on only one, on only collaboration between SOL and importer of Cylinder, so that they can continue to make money. Honestly, our speak as a corporate. That is what we start to be corrected. We might be wrong. Why is it that those cylinders produced by NGMC in Ibadan, in one road in those days, will last 30, 40 years? Yes, we hardly have cases of explosion. But if you table this in occasions like they say, comedy is talking to Isaiah scientist, is the association having a lab? Eh? In the last review, that brought the age of cylinder to 15 from 30 or 25 years thereabouts. We argue a lot. At the end of the day, we agree for 15 years. Then we qualification, the calibration every five, five years. Up to now, I am not aware of one calibration center. So if I use the China cylinder for five years, I want to know if the cylinder is still, its integrity is still inside. Where is that qualification center? If the government is not willing to invest in that licensed people across your political zone, you can as well expand the license power of plant operators. That as you are expand, establishing plants, establish the qualification center. After all, it's not going to be free. If I bring my cylinder to be subjected to tax, I'll pay a token. Yeah. So from that token, they will be making their money. Yeah. I don't know if I'm making sense. Yeah. But they have not created a communication center. So technically, you have reduced the life of cylinder to five years like my other said. Technically, even though you are writing 15 years. And I don't want to agree, sir, eh, that you are powerless. You are, um, you are empowered by law uh, to money importer of not only cylinder, cable manufacturers. I know of a time I don't want to mention it. There's a particular engineer in charge of LPG at the headquarter that we are so close to. He has been transferred like three, four years ago to the East. I don't want to mention his name. I know that SON even follow the portal of cylinder to India, yeah. to China. Have you? They monitor. So why is it at the end of the day, they still bring something that is not? And that is why a lot of us, I remember, find it difficult to lift those old cylinder. If you experience explosion of cylinder, then eh, China are in it. And yes, lab is telling me that that one that hardly explode is not bad. Can you see why we now conclude that it's a collaboration to make money? Maybe there is a return. Are you, are you getting what I'm saying? Maybe, but no, it's an assumption. When a unionist is taking an agenda, you can need three items. They will throw them to the government. Eh? Is that left for government to start pulling it down? It is left for SOL to prove us wrong that we don't have anything or no need with this. And another angle is that when you are giving license for importation of cylinder, Maybe you need to include the for them to have a requalification center. Let me take you back a bit, sir. Before, maybe I'll say 1990 or up to early 1990, cylinders are owned by marketers. IG gas of this world, now turn or handle. Shell, total, they have their own cylinder. From October, last week of October, if we go to figures in our papa in those days, if we go to figures in our papa as a distributor, as you are unfolding your truck, they will give themselves testing cylinder. There's no way they do it. Anyone they consider not fit, they will seize it and replace it for us, free of charge. Because it's their cylinder. 
since the era of deregulation, uh, a lot of deregulation, marketing this information we used to use to deceive ourselves. Open market economy and a typical Igbo man in Alaba who does not know anything about cylinder, who has not invested into LPG, he does not have plants import cylinder from China. He's only interested in selling. Are you getting it now? So nobody takes responsibility for the ownership of cylinder. We were at a seminar in Abuja sometimes last quarter of last year, organized by NMPC retail. They are talking about adoption of model. They are sold the Indonesia model, China model, India model, Indonesia model, maybe China or one other country. Which one is it? For Nigeria going to adopt. For as long as there is no ownership of Senegal, that equation is not settled. We continue to confront issue of Senegal safety. We always fight with SOM if they come on the street to start confiscating Senegal. We tell them they should go to the point. They used to have access to the ports. They are the ones that give license to people that bring cylinder. Wanting a poor man on the streets. If that's what you want to do, go to individual house now and start searching their cylinder. So we need to work more on this. We only say this. Most of most often times we all want a good country. We are, we are not very good people. So our big brothers, the plant operators. I only say them at any forum. 